we'll give it a shot here. Well, you know, I hit it. Oh, I think I missed. I missed again. I hit it that time. I think that's it. That's it. So with the 38 special, I hit it four out of six times at 15 yards and I got a pretty decent group. I'll pan the camera around so you can see where I did and then we'll shoot some 357 Magnum out of it. That's the first six shots out of the Ruger Blackhawk with 38 special, four hit the plate, I think two I shot over it. So I picked up this gun the other day and really wasn't shopping for it, wasn't in the market for it, but a friend of mine had acquired it in a an estate and uh, he had no use for it, so he wanted to see if I was interested in it. And for the price, uh, I couldn't pass it up. Uh, it was a really good price on this. But anyway, what we're looking at here is a Ruger Blackhawk, and it's the new Blackhawk. Let's see if I can get this to show up. And of course, it's in 357 Magnum. I looked it over, uh, it looks really good. It has been shot, you can tell that it has been used, probably needs a good cleaning right now. But other than that, uh, to me it looks really good. I did find a little bit of wear right here on the bottom of that strap. I don't know, yeah, right there. Just a little bit, little scratches right there, but other than that, the gun looks really good. I did find something else today, and I don't know if this will show up, but it looks like the front sight has been painted with something. And I'm wondering if maybe they painted it with some type of glow in the dark or whatever, but... I don't know if this will show up. You can see a little bit of where it ran right there off the edge. But anyway, I'm going to try and clean that off uh, as best I can. And go from there. But anyway. That's my new Ruger Blackhawk in 357 Magnum. I'm going to get things set up here and I have a plate that we'll shoot at. The plate is right there at 15 yards and that is a 8 inch plate. I'm going to see if I can hit it. No guarantees. Alright, I'm going to try the 357 at 15 yards. Wish me luck.
All right, six for six. Ruger Blackhawk, new model Blackhawk, yeah, shooting 357 at 15 yards, eight inch plate. So those are my hits with the 357. You can definitely tell the difference between those and the that one spot right above that group that is a 38 special. So I'll put a little bit of paint back on that plate and uh, we'll shoot it again. All right, the new Ruger Blackhawk and 357 shooting 357, eight inch plate, 15 yards. All right, shooting uh, the new Ruger Blackhawk using 38 specials this time. Again, eight inch plate, 15 yards. All right, we're going to shoot another round of 357s at the plate. I'm going to see if I can't uh, hit it six times out of six. Obviously not. So right when I pull the trigger, I know if I'm going to miss or hit. And what's happening is I just have that little bit left right at the end of the barrel. And this is a short barrel, so I really shouldn't have too much of that. But just a little bit of my left or right, and I'm going to miss one way or the other. But anyway, the last four, yeah, the last four were in there, so... We'll call it a day. Hopefully this will show up on camera. I can't, cannot see the uh, monitor. But anyway, with this uh, new Ruger Blackhawk, you don't have a half cock in here. So you just open that swing gate and you work your uh, ejector if you want to call it that so to get the cylinder to spin you have to open that gate with it closed it will not spin. 
another thing this thing has a transfer bar in here a type of safety I don't know if that's going to show up or not it's right there uh, so that's a couple of the new things with the new Ruger Blackhawk one last thing I wanted to say is that the ammo I was using was the 38 special were federal American Eagles these were about uh, for 50 rounds it was $33 and then I have some Blazer Brass Case uh, 357 Magnum. They are hollow point, uh, jacketed hollow point. These are, are lead round nose. So let's see, I'll just show you. That's the 38 Special. And then the 357 Magnum is a jacketed hollow point and they were uh, 48 bucks for 50 so that was the ammo I was using today and uh, again that's the new model Blackhawk Ruger 357 Magnum